Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 20 powerful comic book characters. For this list, we'll be focusing on physical power and awesome physical abilities, as opposed to cunning, wealth, or weapons and tools that provide physical advantages. This means that you won't be seeing any characters that are pretty much just physically strong. We're talking real, raw power here. Number 20, Scarlet Witch. This is the very first entry on our list, and we can already hear people furiously typing in the comments. Depending on the specific time period that we're talking about, Wanda could arguably be placed significantly higher on this list, more so than most of the characters on our list. However, Wanda Maximoff's powers have been portrayed very inconsistently. Much like it took until WandaVision for her to reach her full potential in the MCU, the Scarlet Witch has spent decades in the comics underperforming. At her best, however, this one-time Avenger can harness her chaos magic and use it to rewrite reality itself. As the Nexus being of Earth-616, she's a key figure in keeping the multiverse in balance. Number 19, Thanos. The fact that this character only comes in at number 19 is a real testament to the sort of stakes we're dealing with. This isn't the big league, it's the biggest league possible. Because he was at the heart of the most epic cinematic crossover event in history, Thanos' influence often gets mistaken for power. He snuffed out half of all life in the universe, sure, but that was using the Infinity Gauntlet. Minus that handy accessory, Thanos still scores top marks for strength and speed. He's also up there in terms of durability. Thanos is considered to be the most powerful of the Eternals of Titans, and that's saying a lot. Over time, his various enhancements and upgrades have made him nigh invulnerable and a threat to the universe itself. Number 18, Spawn. In the gritty 90s, this Image Comics icon was seemingly everywhere you turned. While he may have retreated from the spotlight, he remains as powerful as ever. Who else on this list can claim to have banished both God and the Devil? That's the nice thing about Spawn playing in a smaller sandbox than Marvel and DC characters. He can do things that rock his universe to the core. Over the course of his lengthy comic book history, Spawn has repeatedly seen his powers depleted, changed, and seriously upgraded. His body is composed of the necroplasm that fuels him, and he can essentially channel his magic into any ability his mind can conjure up, from breathing fire to raising the dead and more. Number 17, Galactus. Galen, the devourer of worlds, the great destroyer, planet killer, the hunger that does not cease. Galactus is known by many names across the cosmos. Some of his titles have surely been lost to history, having been given to him by one of the many civilizations that he has wiped off the galactic map when he consumed their world. In terms of the power grid, Galactus maxes out pretty much all the metrics. He's not much of a fighter, but who needs to be when you're this big? A survivor of a previous incarnation of the multiverse, Galactus possesses the Power Cosmic, which gives him the sort of power that it's difficult to quantify. When he fights with a cosmic being of comparable stature, reality itself is affected. Number 16, Phantom Stranger. Now the world of DC Comics enters the fray. Though he might look like your run-of-the-mill caped hero circa 1952, this unique character is working with far more than your typical utility belt. Shrouded in mystery, the Phantom Stranger has a number of conflicting origin stories, but they all take him back to biblical times, heaven itself, or a previous version of the universe. His early exploits in the comics were relatively trivial efforts, common mysteries and minor magical threats. Over the years, however, he's revealed himself to be immortal, a traveler of time and various dimensions, and capable of awe-inspiring magical feats. With these various godlike abilities, and having once been described as neither living nor dead, the Phantom Stranger defies categorization. Number 15, Dormammu. While the Sorcerer Supreme certainly took the piss out of him in 2016's Doctor Strange, Dormammu is not a figure you should take lightly. He hails from an alternate dimension populated by powerful beings called the Fall Team. Here, he consumed matter until he became the most powerful sorcerer of his kind. Those who are power-hungry, however, are rarely satisfied, and he was eventually cast out to wander the multiverse. Over the millennia, he eventually became the ruler of the Dark Dimension, and his incomprehensible powers have only continued to grow. He would probably rank even higher if those powers were not diminished outside the Dark Dimension. Number 14, Franklin Richards. 
Okay, so you know how Galactus has had various heralds like Silver Surfer, Fire Lord, and Nova? Well, Galactus became the herald of Franklin Richards. So, that gives you an idea of the sort of power we're talking about here. The son of Reed Richards and Sue Storm, Franklin got his powers from the same cosmic radiation that gave his parents their mutations. In his case, however, the radiation resulted in him being born an Omega-level mutant. His classification has since been upgraded a few times over to the point where it almost doesn't matter. Franklin draws his energy from a dimension composed entirely of raw power. Even as a small child, his reality-warping abilities have made him among the most powerful beings in the universe. Number 13. Sentry Had things turned out differently, Robert Reynolds would have been Marvel's greatest superhero. In many ways, he feels like the Marvel version of Superman, right down to the fact that he draws his power from the sun. Department K's Golden Sentry Serum aims to increase the results of Captain America's Super Soldier Serum 100,000 times over. As Reynolds discovered, it worked. Initially, the newly christened Sentry lived up to his potential as a hero of incomparable power, forming close bonds with other heroes and even mentoring Spider-Man. Unfortunately, there's a dark half to the Sentry called the Void, which uses those same limitless powers to devastating effect. There are few characters in any dimension that he cannot overpower. Number 12. Necron Bringing back all the friends and allies that comic book heroes have lost over the years to serve as his Black Lantern Corps? That's a move that earned Necron a spot in comic book history. His servant, Black Hand, was the face of this landmark Green Lantern crossover event, but Necron was the power behind Blackest Night. First introduced in the early 80s, Necron is Death Incarnate, a cosmic force that serves as the antithesis of life. He is connected to all that which is not life, the endless darkness. He can raise the dead to serve as his minions and pull strength from every life he takes. Throw in reality manipulation, immortality, and his dark lightning, and he's not a force you want to find yourself facing. Number 11. Phoenix Force The higher you get on this list, the more complicated the characters become. Some, like the Phoenix Force, are better described as entities or sentient forces than actual characters. Comic book readers were first introduced to the Phoenix Force when it bonded with Jean Grey to make her the Dark Phoenix. As one of the most powerful telepathic and telekinetic mutants in history, Jean already brings a lot to the table, but when she's serving as avatar of the Phoenix Force, she becomes a cosmic threat. The Phoenix Force by itself is among the strongest entities in the Marvel Universe. The center of all psionic energy, its powers include mastery over all of existence and nigh omnipotence. With the right host, it's unstoppable. Number 10. Mr. Mixelpitalik This list is populated by an assortment of awe-inspiring beings with designs to match. Mr. Mixelpitalik, by contrast, is just about the most underwhelming-looking villain in Superman's rogues gallery. Be that as it may, he is not to be underestimated. An imp hailing from the fifth generation, he's kind of Superman's perfect foil. Blessed with seemingly limitless magical abilities, old Mixie can rewrite matter and reality to suit his needs, even twisting the logic and function of the multiverse. As such, he makes it very hard for Superman to punch or zap him. Thankfully, Mr. Mixelpitalik is more interested in mischief than any overt acts of destruction. But don't mistake his lighthearted ways for low risk. If he wanted to, he could bring about calamity. Number 9. Dr. Manhattan While many fans have had mixed feelings about Dr. Manhattan being brought into the mainstream DC continuity, it came with certain perks. Finally, we were able to see how Dr. Manhattan stacked up against the greatest heroes of this reality. Unsurprisingly, we learned that he's playing on a totally different level. Even Mr. Mixel Pitalix has admitted that he can't hold a candle to the big blue guy. Dr. Manhattan was retroactively credited with both the Flashpoint event and the creation of the New 52. A post-human god born of a lab accident involving atomic physics, Jonathan Osterman became Dr. Manhattan. He is a quantum being who is effectively all-powerful and all-knowing. Traveling between time, dimensions, and altering reality as he sees fit, Dr. Manhattan just does his thing. Number 8. Molecule Man You wouldn't know it from his relatively low profile in pop culture, but Molecule Man is among the most powerful villains in Marvel Comics. If anything, it's his earth-shattering powers that often force him onto the sidelines. With our modern understanding of science and matter, his abilities make him a non-starter for the average rogues gallery. 
In the 1960s, he was simply using his molecular manipulation to craft force fields, open portals, and deliver concussive energy blasts. And so he was perfect for duking it out with Fantastic Four or Iron Man. Nowadays, he can rewrite reality on a multiversal scale. Galactus has recognized that Molecule Man could end him with a thought. Realistically, the label Molecule Man doesn't do him justice. Number 7. Spectre Often spoken of in the same breath as Phantom Stranger, Spectre is another DC character who prefers to stick to the fringes. Shrouded in mystery, this cosmic being is God's vengeance given form. Rather than getting involved with conventional superheroes, the Spectre is bonded with a human soul and tasked with punishing the wicked. Various humans have donned the mantle over the years, but the responsibilities of being the Spectre and the perspective that comes with it often result in a rather consistent, detached mannerism. Given his divine mission, Spectre typically uses a fraction of his powers, but as shown when he occasionally gets involved with cosmic threats, God has granted him nearly limitless magical abilities. Number 6. Lucifer Morningstar Like the biblical figure with whom he shares a name, Lucifer is a fallen angel who ruled over hell after his rebellion against God. Unsatisfied with his dominion, however, and forever drawn towards the human world, he chose to abandon his kingdom and today spends the majority of his time living a life of indulgence on the mortal plane of Earth. Don't let his casual demeanor fool you. Lucifer Morningstar maintains all his God-given powers as an archangel. The only one who can really give him a run for his money is angelic brother Michael Demaragos. Together, they're capable of creations on the scale of the DC multiverse itself. Lucifer is a born rebel, though, and so he flexes his nigh omnipotence more readily. Number 5. Eternity Comic book superheroes and villains give themselves all manner of cool, self-aggrandizing names. Considering his sister is Infinity, however, it quickly becomes clear that Eternity is more than just a name. Consider yourself warned, now that we're in the top 5, things are going to get weird. Across the Marvel multiverse, there is an Eternity in each reality. Altogether, however, they also make up a single entity known as Eternity. This is the true Eternity, a character who encompasses the current iteration of the multiverse in its entirety. As such, it's been hypothesized that Eternity technically has all the abilities of all your favorite characters in the Marvel Universe and its various dimensions. Number 4. The Beyonder Once upon a time, the Beyonder would have been at the top of this list. He was said to explicitly have been more powerful than all remaining Marvel characters to be discussed. Hailing from an ancient race that exists outside of the multiverse, the Beyonder is utterly unlike any other character within the Marvel Universe. Every being and entity within the multiverse is an incomplete part of a larger whole. In the Beyonder's reality, however, every individual is said to be the be-all and end-all of their own reality. As such, he was able to see, understand, and manipulate the multiverse as a whole. Over the years, however, the Beyonder has repeatedly had his powers downgraded, but he remains a master manipulator of reality. Number 3. The Living Tribunal Co-created by none other than the late great Stan Lee, the Living Tribunal is a force that even the most powerful Marvel characters dare not challenge. This three-headed entity exists within the multiverse itself rather than any single dimension. As old as the universe, the Living Tribunal functions as a check and balance for the multiverse, ensuring that magical forces never destabilize the cosmic balance. One universe amassing too much energy, a gross imbalance of good and evil in the multiverse, these are the issues with which the Living Tribunal is concerned, not the conflicts of earthly or galactic villains. We're talking about a being with power on an incomprehensible scale. Though for what it's worth, the Living Tribunal apparently isn't much of a fighter. Number 2. One Above All That's the sort of name that says it all. In the Marvel Universe, it does not get any more powerful than the One Above All. The term Nigh Omnipotent has appeared a number of times on this list because, well, we're dealing with a lot of gods, godlike beings, and cosmic entities. The one above all, however, is omnipotent, omniscient, and omnipresent. No ifs, ands, buts, qualifiers, or caveats. This is the entity that created all life in all realities in all iterations past and present of the Marvel Universe. In a more meta sense, the one above all is seemingly the embodiment of the Marvel creators and editors.
And at the end of the day, all these characters only live by the grace of the pen and scissors of these mighty beings. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Doctor Strange, the Sorcerer Supreme with his mastery of the mystic arts, is not to be underestimated. Anti-Monitor, master of the antimatter universe, this DC villain is committed to destruction. Professor Charles Xavier, this powerful and influential alpha-level mutant is Earth's greatest telepath. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. The Presence Within the world of DC Comics, there is no entity more powerful than the Presence. The god or creator of all existence, it has taken on various forms and titles over the course of comic book history. When dealing with the Spectre, the Presence is often referred to simply as the Voice. The Hand, a literal giant hand, is said to have been seen by various characters at critical junctures in time, including the DC Universe Big Bang. Given that the Presence is everywhere and everything, this entity simply cannot be destroyed, as proven in JLA Paradise Lost. As such, this being has also been referred to as the Source, for all things emanate from this entity of incomprehensible power. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.